In immersion cooling, you're submersing the server in a non-conductive fluid that has better heat transfer properties for the server. So you're able to cool the server much more effectively than you would be if you used air cooling. Hi, my name is John Esquier, VP of Technology at Argo Blockchain. Our tanks were chosen for their form factor with the servers that we're choosing to use for immersion and for our specific power densities that we're using at the facility. My name is Sam Mantash. I'm a project manager with Argo Blockchain. Immersion cooling technology consists of using non-conductive oil to extract the heat produced by the electronics. This allows them to run cooler, uh, therefore have a longer lifespan, and allows us to maybe push them a little bit more than what they're supposed to. The dry coolers that you see behind me, um, they kind of act like a giant radiator. Uh, so think of it from a car perspective. Most uh, internal combustion cars have a big radiator in the front to help keep the engine cool. So these giant air coolers will help keep the oil at a low temperature. So you can go as, as crazy and as intense as you want. So from, from the tanks to the, to the actual flow plates, to the specifications of the hoses, the air cooler, the oil use, you know, nothing is off the shelf. So everything is made for Argo.